morning. Well, here we are in Oldborough on the Suffolk coast, ready to do another amazing walk. This time on the Suffolk coastal path and a bit of inland up to the nuclear power station at Sizewell. So that should be interesting. Come along, let's see. Fine old church here in Alborough. And the footpath takes us this way through the churchyard. Okay, off that busy road, down past another golf course to find the Red House, whatever that is. So this is the Red House, and apparently it's the home of uh, Sir Benjamin Britten and Peter Pears. That's where they live together as chums, and it's now an art gallery. And if uh, a museum to their lives. Worth a visit, I guess, if you're in this region. And this path we're walking on at the moment seems to be skirting around the outskirts of uh, Aldborough. Um, we've got houses to our left and the golf course still to our right. But shortly we'll be striking out into the heathland that lies behind the coast of this part of Suffolk and heading up to uh, Sizewell. And here's our path across a golf course. Oh joy, you know how I love walking across golf courses. Oh well, here we go. So it's mid-September at the time of this walk. It might be a bit later on when you watch it. It's already signs of autumn all around us. So we find ourselves now on the Sandlings Way, which we're going to follow for a while. Um, finally heading in the direction of Sizewell. Uh, we've been uh, walking in the opposite direction uh, since we left Aldborough and see what this is like. Right, on to the old railway that used to go to Aldborough through Thorpness from Southwold. We're going to follow this for a bit and on the map it looks like we're going to see some interesting wetlands in a minute. So I guess this was here before the power station, Sizewell Hall, 
now a Christian conference centre. And through the pillars of Sizewell Hall, you can just get a glimpse of the new Sizewell nuclear power station. Some men in black uniforms coming out in a minute. Why are you taking pictures? And here, right by the gates of Sizewell nuclear power station, is the Vulcan Arms. Presumably they've all got pointy ears because of the radiation. Anyway, looks like a place for a pint. Right, nice pint. Off to find the sea and the route back to Oldborough. coming into Thorpe Ness where I think we'll stop for a spot of lunch. So these oldie worldy buildings were built in the 1930s as holiday cottages when this place was developed as one of the original holiday villages. Not all is as it seems. In the middle of Thorpe Ness we have this little village green with its very own boating lake. I think we might stop here and eat our sandwiches. So apparently this was dug in the early part of the 20th century and as J.M. Barry was a friend of the Ogilvy family who were responsible for this, a lot of it's themed around Peter Pan. There we are. wasn't our great walk. Here we are back in uh, Alborough, just by the bait shop. We're going to just walk back to where we live now. Fantastic walk, lots of variation, lots of lovely countryside, beautiful beaches. Fantastic. Hope you enjoyed it as much as I did and I look forward to seeing you on the next one. Bye for now. <laughs>